Hey everybody, got another kind of a reaction video. As I say, we are going to watch a video this time, and um, I am going to do a decode. Um, it's going to be a little bit more than a halfway kind of decode, basically meaning, you know, say about 60 to 70%. I'm not going to go all the way, as I say, there is more than enough um, relevant stuff that's all going on right now pertaining to stuff to do with racism and to understand the nature of the whole Gamantri community. Again, whether the story is real, not real, or a mix of true lies, understand the dynamics of this code that they use to create, you know, the world as you know it, as <laughs> around you, you know, coupled with all the, um, you know, despair, divisive news, war, this thing going on, that thing, coronavirus, blah, 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 blah. So again, shout out to China Mac before I continue. I really hope that you get to see this, this video. And again, because you've got eyes, obviously people, you know, on your channel. I hope, you know, you take it in. You go through the videos, relevant stuff like Black History Month, George Floyd, etc, etc. You see how repetitive in nature all of this is through history. <laughs> yeah. And, um, you know, you, you comprehend it and then forward that info on. To all your followers again i'm not expecting you to straight away give me a shout out or or anybody in the community or start linking videos or anything obviously you know everybody's at their own speed with how they um you know take in knowledge or new, something new so that's obviously fair play whatever whatever the case may be and um, again i just hope that you come with a healthy uh, approach to what you're looking at as i say with what's being uh, it's trying to be explained here and being explained how many times so redundant and again, I'm going to play the video and then I'm going to get back into um, uh, what we need to get into with this story. So, as I say, I literally just saw it and I was like, oh, I need to make a video. So, again, it's not like scripted as such. Obviously, you've got some train of thought because I know my numbers to a degree. But anyway, let's let the man try on the Mac roll. We've got the video from the news is going to be watching as well. Let me hit play on this. Wow. Now to an eyewitness who's exclusive, an 89-year-old grandmother targeted in Brooklyn by two men. They never said a word before they slapped her and lit her clothes on fire. Tonight, she's telling her terrifying story of survival to eyewitness news reporter Safan Kim. Mo, this 89-year-old grandmother says she pulled her hair up so it wouldn't burn then rubbed her back against the wall to put out the flames. In this eyewitness news exclusive, speaking in Cantonese through a translator, the victim says it was last week, Tuesday night, in Bensonhurst, Brooklyn, when two men committed the... Yo, I can't even watch this no more. Yo, I can't even explain how upset I am watching this. Like, she's 89 years old. 89 years old, and two men attacked her. Like, bro, this is disgusting. And... I can't, I can't, I can't not do nothing about this. And if you watching this, and if you're a human being, and you got family, you got a grandmother, you got a mother, you got some people that you love, and you look at this, and it doesn't make you feel something, something is wrong. Definitely. We cannot this is, no, don't get me wrong with that, you know. This is the shit that will spark that anger immediately, like instantly, immediately. And before I even let the man continue playing, I don't even mean to interject. But you just have to understand. I'm going to say it anyway. Again, and I'm, do you know what? Let me let him finish him uh, uh, speaking. I don't even mean to interject. But obviously, you know, this is what it's set out to do. Whether it's real or not. I'm not saying whether it's real or not, by the way. Yeah, I'm going to explain this again. I'm going to let the man finish talking right now. Let's go back 20 seconds. Bro, this is disgusting. It I can't, I can't, I can't not do nothing about this. And if you watching this, and if you're a human being, and you got family, you got a grandmother, you got a mother, you got some people that you love, and you look at this, and it doesn't make you feel something, something is wrong. We cannot tolerate this. I'm not going to stand around and allow this shit to happen again. So you know what we're doing? Saturday at Seth Lowe Playground, 3 p.m., Bay and 75th, we're all going to meet up over there. I don't care if you're from New York City. I don't care if you're in California. I don't care if you're in Montgomery. If you look at this video and it made you feel something, I expect to see you there. Catch a flight. Come see me at Cephalo Playground, 
I don't care where you at. Everybody needs to be over here, and we need to show them that we are not going to stand for this no more. Not just because Asians, but people, period. Mm, Humanity, exactly. period. 89 years old, two men attacking her. We, we're not taking that. We're not taking that. I'll see you there Saturday. Facts. All right, let's continue. So we're going to get into the decode now. Should I make it? Yeah, actually. Let's make it the whole screen. So, here's the news post, New York Post. Elderly woman says she was slapped and set on fire by silent attackers. No, the news article for the situation is on the 25th. Note, NYPD News, their tweet, they say it happened on uh, July 14th, right? Sure, that was a Tuesday, but anyway, at 6.45, yeah? Near 16th Avenue and 77th Street, Brooklyn. They slapped an 89-year-old in the face, and then lit her shirt with a match or lighter. If you have any information, blah, 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 blah. Get in contact, right? So here's the perps. Fucking scumbags. Obviously, you know. And this is what I want to say as well. One, you've got the monkey see, monkey do effect where they putting out these type of stories and then dumb asses are going to actually go out and carry out stupid acts. Yeah? You know, you were in the time of COVID now. Oh, it came from China. Blah, blah, blah. Do you know what I mean? Shit like that. Yeah. So again, whether it's the monkey see, monkey do, or if it was a um, um, you know set up and the situation didn't even happen. As I said, I'm not saying that with this story. I'm just saying. So whether it's monkey see, monkey do, or if it was a complete you know contrived thing from the you know who's. Or however it's done, or if it was organic, this is my point. So I've gone back to organic, or if it was all organic, understand the number system that's used with all these stories, captions. It doesn't matter if it's a rapper's death, it doesn't matter if it's, you know what I mean, uh, Wayan's mom that just happened the other day, blah, 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 blah. I mean, I could go on. Again, check out Black Lives, I mean, not the Black Lives Matter, Black History Month playlist 2020. You want to check out, of course, George Floyd, all relevant stuff. Um, Althea Bernstein. Um, check out the um, Bianca Williams playlist as well. You'll find them in the George Floyd uh, playlist anyway, but they're also, you know, playlist on their own. But understand what the reason for all this number system is and how it keeps us induced in Groundhog's Day, keeps us sleep, keeps us dizzy, yeah? As I say, I'm trying to not go into it too much and too, too, like, over um, sidebarring and stuff because there's so much that's already been said on my channel and others. So again, you know, check out <laughs> what's there, what I've been, you know, what I'm speaking about right now, stuff that's left in the description, etc., etc. So, an elderly, an elderly Brooklyn woman briefly set on fire, yeah? by two men who never spoke a word during the heinous attack, according to a report. The 89-year-old victim, speaking in Cantonese through a translator, told the news reporter people, you know, ABC NY, the goons approached her near, near her house, etc. Now, what I want to get to, when was the article again? 25th, right? So the article about what happened, you know, a couple of weeks back or whatever, on the 25th, talking about what happened a week back, or just over, on the 14th, fire equals 25. Interesting. And the reflection 52. We don't even have to go that far. We don't even have to go that far. There's a few other things I could go into right now, but I, I, you know, I don't want to bombard you if you are watching this video, um, China Map, with too much right now. But just understand, obviously, fire can cause death. And things like murder, death, kill, cancer, destroy, found dead, collapsed, drowned. All these things equal 83, 38. 
Look up the song by a band called The Police that came out in 1983 called Murder by Numbers. Yeah? So again, Fire 38, Set a Light 38. A few more things there, but I'm not, I don't want to be too extra right now. Now, they say she speaks Cantonese or from Cantonese, yeah? Origin, etc. Living in, you know, in the city, New York, Brooklyn, etc. Interesting. When did it happen? 14th of July. You see the 147 on the end? 14th of July. 14 slash 7. Go into the middle now. We've got the 48. Race war equals 48. And race war equals 33. I could speak about the 42, but I'm not even going to go into that right now. If you go through the videos, again, George Floyd playlist and all relevant playlists that I already said, you will understand. The magnitude of the spell. Again, spelling, the old name for God is Tetragrammaton. Here we are dealing with grammar, hence why in the Bible that's been remixed by the you know who's. That's why it goes, uh, it says, let's go down and confuse them with language. You see? As I say, it gets explained so many times and if you read it, you, can, you will catch it. I'll leave it even under this video anyway. Something that I'll always leave with all my videos so you can read it there. Also, Race Bowl 33, Cantonese 33. We're gonna get back to something significant in a second as well that we've already seen, but you didn't realize it. Now, note. Elderly woman equals 147. Here we are talking about an elderly woman that's 89 years old, right? That they're trying to set a light and shit which is some obvious fucked up shit, be it real or not. And again, you need to understand how they play on us with this spell system, yeah? So ritualistically, how, how it plays on us, and then it will incite us to think and do things, you know what I mean? And do things that you didn't even realize you was gonna do because of the whole monkey mind effect. You know what I mean? And keeping us inundated and with this stream of frequency, you know? Again, not, focal point in our energy correctly with our anger. I'm not saying it's not supposed to be getting mad right now. <laughs> it could be a real story. I'm not saying it's not a real story. I'm just saying, be it a real story and then understanding the code behind the news and then how it's presented with all this number system and then how it goes through history, the same code, specific numbers and sequence you will see for a certain situation over and over again. You know what I mean? So, Cantonese. 14 slash 7, we've got the 147, it happened on the 14th of July. We've got um, elderly woman equals 147, like 14 slash 7, 100 and, uh, 14th of July. Elderly by itself, 36, like racism equals 36. We'll get back to Brooklyn in a second. Oh, we'll get to it now. With the life lesson 25 fire and the date of the article. Speaking about what happened on July 14th with a life lesson of 25. Brooklyn 41, you've got the numerology of 41. You see what I'm saying, cuz? You see? Now, there's a few more potent things that you need to understand. Also, as we move along here, hold up. Here's the perps. Fucking scumbags beat the case. Be it that they're fucking sent out from the you know who's to come and you know what I mean? Cause and effect. Think about it. Clearly, surely, you, uh, China back, you know, and your viewers and whoever else that might be watching the video, surely you must have seen the police leaving all the fucking bricks and inciting, you know, smashing up the shops with all the George Floyd protest stuff going on. Fucking hell. So that's what I'm saying. Don't ever think that this couldn't be also that type of shit as well. You know what I mean? Fucking hell. But again, you know, never rule out it could be the monkey mind effect. That shit that I was half explaining before. As I say, go through the videos. I have explained stuff better before. <laughs> but, you know, I'm not, I'm not that eloquent with my wording and stuff. But hopefully, it's, I'm driving something home here. Now, again, July 14th, Cantonese. What is it? Uh, elderly woman. Shit, let me get that back there. Elderly Brooklyn woman. No, no, no. Cantonese and elderly woman, 147. Now... Remember, we had the, from the NYPD, look, 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 at 6.45, remember, elderly 36, racism equals 36, and 45, it also equals 99. 
Eric Garner, the police officer. He had the 99 on his top. Pressure to the jugular vein on your neck causes asphyxiation. Asphyxiation equals 62. I'm sure Eric Garner or Garner equals 62. And what I'm getting to is racism 99, jugular equals 99. And if you've, as I say, you watch <laughs> all the 99s with the latest stuff with George Floyd, you know, <laughs> I mean, as I say, feel free to leave me a comment when you get through to watching those. So again, racism 45, hence why it's 45 minutes past. Unbelievable. There it is right there, just in case you think I'm bullshitting. Again, the alphabet order, A's one, Z's 26, that's the dark green, English ordinal, then you reverse it. Then you've got the dark blue one, which is the full reduction, bringing all double digits down to a single digit. Oh, well, S, the 19th letter. And all of that type of stuff. Oh, you know, sorry, because that goes with the single reduction. Basically, with single reduction, S gets brought down once from 19 to 10. And then with full reduction, it gets brought down to 1. But again, you've got the 36 elderly, you've got the time 645, you've got the 99 stuff. Juggler Eric Garner, um, or, or, or Just Garner equals 99. You've got the 62 asphyxiation. Juggler, 99. And you know what I mean? It's just... And as I say, if you go through those videos, you will see. So, let's continue. As I say, if I was doing a full-on decode, trust me, you would be getting it right now. <laughs> and it will be fully ordered. But because I'm not fully in the mind for that right now, you know what I mean? As I say, you'll understand if you go through my last so many videos, you'll, you'll see what I'm saying. And just through time anyway. <laughs> you'll definitely hear me saying some stuff. And you'll definitely see me going through certain motions when I'm proper fucking pissed off. Yeah? <laughs> proper vex. Proper pissed off. At the madness and the buffoonery that we're being subjected to. And, you know what I mean? And all the layered fucking forms of it going on. So anyway, slapped equals 35. They said that they slapped her, right? Now, for today... Oh, hold up. Sorry, for the on the 24th, because... Let me get the, the right slide up here. You see how the police have got it? So the news itself is on the 25th, 5 equals 25, and then we've got the 25 life lesson, life lesson with the 14th of July. And then we've got now the 24th is when the tweet was done, yeah, with this picture via the NYPD, yeah? So let's go back up to here now. So... On the 24th, you can see up here, 24th of July, has a life lesson of 35. Slapped <laughs> equals 35. Yeah? And not to mention the mind control with the 160. Notice we had the whole uh, uh, toilet paper madness going on. Yeah, toilet paper. You see how we had the full house? I'll just quickly show you. See from left to right, from dark blue to green. If I write out toilet paper, uh, mind control is a full house, left to right. Think about that, royal family, left to right, full house. Yeah, there's more that goes with that, but I don't want to be bombard you with too much right now if you're new to the topic. But again, just understand, this is how they play God over us. Again, the old name for God, Tetragrammaton. Grammar, spelling, dialects, language, linguistics, the Hegelian dialect. You know, again, go through, go through the uploads. You will catch stuff being talked about. You know, rappers, you, you'll see it. All the rappers, therefore, you know, would sidebar about stuff to do with Tupac. As I said, I would go into that right now, but I'm not going to go into that right now. If you actually was to message or something after watching this video and ask me to, I'll definitely do it. <laughs> That's not a problem. And to my viewers, if there is something you're going to give me a heads up on or refer me to for a reactionary semi-decode video obviously you know what to do hence why we caught that gem of a one we caught earlier via Callum O'Connor with the this morning with the baby Lucifer <laughs> unfucking believable oh and as I'm on this topic of uh, my community wall China Mac be sure to check out my community wall I put up a, a, a really a bit but a lot of Potent posts are on my community wall at the minute. 
where I haven't been putting them into video form. So uh, be sure to check those out. Now, civil rights happened in 64, the civil, civil war and all that type of stuff. Anyway, civil rights, 71, if you know, above the 2035 for slaps, we've got the 71. Of course, you know, we're dealing with people, civil rights, civ you know, your liberty and stuff. Again, civil rights, 71. Now, what was the place? 16, 16th Ave and 77th Street, Brooklyn. <laughs> and then Cantonese 33, Race War 33, the 33rd Triangular Number, 1 or 2 or 3 or 4 up to... No, sorry, the 77th Triangular Number, 1 or 2 or 3 or 4 up to 77 equals 3003. Drop the zeros, it's the same equivalent, yeah? So Race War 33, Cantonese 33, People, Police, Society 33. Jesus died at 33. They give you the third degree when they pull you over. Anyway, racism 63. Race, race 27. You got the 207. Racism equals 27 as well. Again, racism 45. They give us the time. It happens at 645. Also, ritual 27 as well. That's another huge one that coincides when you understand what we're looking at. Now, race and races and all that jazz. Look at this. There's race down there, as I said, the 27 stuff, just so you can see it. But anyway, race is 35, slapped 35. Unbelievable. Race is equals 89. Here we have an 89 year old woman. Go figure. And of course, these people are about chaos and all that type of stuff. Chaos equals 19. Hence why we're having the COVID-19 stuff happen 19 years after 9-11. In 2001, of course, go through the videos and you will understand the stuff from the community, Jacozy Truth, Dr. Savage 84, and of course, the man, the living legend, uh, Zachary K. Hubbard on Commentary Effect News. Of course, Simple Truth TV. Everybody, every, we, even the people that don't even make a uh, 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 visual, uh, uh, you know, the recorded ones there, even if you're just doing the blogs, yeah? Shout out to Uno. So let's continue now. Race is 89, 89 year old, yeah? Racial attack. Just in case, you know, <laughs> that wasn't enough for you. Racial, racial attack equals 89. Unbelievable. Yeah, so again, 645, elderly equals 36. And all the rest of the stuff that we've been catching. The name of the street, 16th and 77th something something. Boom, 63. You see? Again, I don't own the news, the timing, I don't, I don't, you know what I mean? All this type of stuff. This is not my doing. <laughs> you get me? So again, this is from UK London. Shout out to you guys on the other side. Not the underside or the side, but just across the stationary plane. And if you haven't worked it out yet, the only spherical part for the ball is the atmosphere. We live inside a hyperboloid torus field of energy. As above, so below. Hence why you have a torso on an aura. And of course, that's the black and white lines that you see across your eyeballs in a dark place or when you're going to sleep. If you pay attention, you'll see some amazing movement. Just check out somebody on my channel and a few people and then you'll see what magnetism does. I can't remember the name. It's a weird name. But anyway, Ken L. Wheeler will definitely get you there. But that's not actually the name of his channel. But if you uh, search that, Ken L. Wheeler, you will find him, find the channel. It's like Thera Pera. Oh my God, I can't remember how you pronounce it. <laughs> Apapathis or something like that. Thera Apapathis, something like that. Anyway, so. And of course, there's other people to learn from as well. On the subject. Of course, check out Brother Sanchez. God, bro, Sanchez has got a couple of channels there. Flat Power as well. There's Race War, we spoke about that, Cantonese 34, and then in conjunction with the 77th Street, with the 77th Triangular number, 3003, drop the zeros. Right, I'm going to try and round this off now, so I hope I've done enough. But again, if not, go through the videos and see how repetitive is, it is. And again, this is the spell that keeps up subdue in Groundhog Day. This is the glue to everything. You're wondering what the fuck's going on, this is it. That this is the systematic system that they use. 
rigged election, war, this thing, that thing. You know what I mean? It, you know, it's just, oh my goodness. I can't stress it enough. Again, you can predict the news. I mean, Zach put out a fucking video a few weeks ago to mark your calendar off, what was it? For the 25 or 52 with a life lesson on just numerology in general. So they marked off the dates. Yeah, with stuff that they've already been clocking, obviously through all the years, been on it, you know, every day for seven years. But I think maybe stuff for weather, especially for the last maybe four years or something like that. I noticed he mentioned four years the other day. I don't know, he's been on this for every day for seven years and I found him four years ago. <laughs> but anyway. Yeah, so he's put out uh, the numerology pertaining to things to do with hurricane and stuff like that, 52, 25, etc. And lo and behold, the other day on the 25th, you had Hurricane Hannah, go figure. <laughs> yeah, and I say, that's not the first time. Yeah, yeah I could, you know, bring up a bazillion entries from him alone as a standalone, and of course the entire community. You know what I mean? Unbelievable. Again, stock market, rig sports, etc., etc. Yeah. Remember, the children of tomorrow are the future of today. They need to be woke up ASAP. I don't even use that term, woke. <laughs> Awakened. You know? ASAP. This shit is just absurd now. Especially where they're mocking us now with the whole COVID-19 stuff. It's just, you know, chemtrails, COVID. It's just like, really? Oh, yeah. So they say um, the 89-year-old uh, lit in the face, right? Lit her... What did they say? Oh, that. Oh my God, I can't even see it properly. So the 89-year-old, whatever happened, sorry, is covering it. But anyway, then lit her shirt with a match, right? Or lighter. Lit equals 14. It happens on 14th of July. <laughs> Unbelievable. Right, that's it. I hope that made sense to you. Um, and if not, obviously hit up in the comments. There's more than enough information. I'll even hit you up on a motherfucking book. But as I say, flip in, download the book. It's linked to it. It's in the description of literally every video. And, um, you know, shit, what can I say? <laughs>